Good morning, everybody. How are you all doing today? Oh, it's Grit. Morning, Grit. Aw, oh, Sleepy. How are you feeling today? Oh. <laughs> Thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate it. Thank you, John. Better, but might do a half day. That's that is completely understandable since you were you were feeling sick yesterday. I would say I am feeling pretty good. I've uh, been looking forward to wrapping up this game and oh, grit. Thank you so much. Thank you for the tier one sub. You are my first, you're my first sub. <laughs> oh, and now you can use the cool emotes. Good morning, Angelic Demon. And good morning, John. John, you were my first bits. <laughs> oh, you've been sick? Yeah, Grit was just saying uh, he's been feeling sick too. It might be, it, it might just be that time of the year. Make sure to drink plenty of water. Uh, get lots of fluids. On a train at 1800. Well, that's that means you're on your way home, though, right? So at least you're on your way back, if I remember right. But yeah, I've been excited uh, about finishing off uh, Here Comes Nico. Uh, I was really, really excited. Uh, it's, it's a little thing, but oh my goodness, it made my day. Uh, so my tweet... Uh, talking about the game with the uh, the chibi art of of me as Nico, uh, it got liked by uh, by the developer of the game Stygian. Uh and I was that that sent me over the moon for like a day. <laughs> it's the weather I should know. I would get sick around this time myself if I was younger. Yeah, I'm around this time of year, my allergies just get kind of kind of worse. Just like my seasonal allergies, I get stuffed up. The weather shifting, pressure in the air shifting. But yeah, once we finish, uh, we finish this today. We're gonna jump into uh, starting Demon Turf, which will be really fun. Here, let's let's switch us over right now. I think we're just about done with this game, too. I think we just need to wrap up the bathhouse uh, and then the final level. Been a few days since I played. Refamiliarize myself. Clocking in, are ya? How about checking this out? Interesting, I was already over there. Oh, but I forgot the map updated. Oh, this sounds pretty. Yeah, it does. This this game has really good music. It's very cute. Oh, there's a blippy in here. Someone threw a huge coin in me. It's giving me a tummy ache. Can you remove it? Dive into me to find it. Sure thing, blippy. It looks really cute. It is. It's so cute. This game is, like, very lovely. And there's, like, no... There's no, like, damage either done by you or to you. So it's, like, it's just a very cozy, comfy game. I don't know if I'm supposed to be jumping along these, but something just tells me I should. There we go. There you go, Blippi.
Oh, it's the it's gonna be the pots. Oh, hello, doggy. Platforming instinct, yes. <laughs> my my platforming instincts are kicking in. I I see it and I'm like, oh, these are lined up perfectly for me to jump between them. They must want me to. Good morning, doggy. There you are. It's little Gabby. Ugh. It's so dark here. I can barely see the three flower pots. How am I supposed to plant anything like this? It's okay, I got you, Gabby. Always trust platforming instincts. Yes. If you're, uh... If your gaming instincts are going off, chances are there's something there or something you gotta do. That was weird. Why did it... Why did it do that? Oh! I see. I... Hmm. Oh, I can put down a whole new pot! That's new. There we go. I was wondering what that was. I didn't realize. Oh no, it's gotten even more complicated. Oh boy. We're starting out the day with some serious thinking. I got it. We got it. Oh my goodness, there's there's so much on this last puzzle. Okay, I see three places that it the the additional pot could go. That would make some sense. I'm gonna just pick one and go from there. Actually, I don't know if that was the right spot. You know what? We're just gonna... Nope, that was not the right spot. We're just gonna run with it. We'll let it reset. Okay, it was one off. Put it here. Nope, oh, that's not going to do it either. Still one off. Okay. At least this music is, like, really relaxing. Oh, thank you so much for the tier 1 sub, Angelic Demon. I really appreciate it. That makes this a little bit better. 
<laughs> that makes it this uh this puzzle all the better. Oh, and now you also have the QD emotes. Okay, where else could this possibly go? It would feel really weird if it was over in this spot, but I'm going to put it here anyways. to be first, but this is fine. I appreciate it all the same. Oh, I accidentally just put that down there. Don't want that. That's funny. It let me just replace it. <laughs> it has to go right here, right? Unless it's like weird, weirdly uh, like sticking out of the side. Maybe I do need to do that. Wait, I think I just did it. I think I have it. Yeah, we, we got it. Took a few tries. But we got there. The power of perseverance. My brother Gunter is really shy. I'm hoping these flowers will help him hurry up and find a partner already. Oh, it looks like you planted all the flowers on this island. I can't really see, but here's a reward anyways. Sometimes a little sister just needs to scare her big brother. Don't look at me like that. You're complicit. <laughs> I guess I am. I have been planting all these flowers. Let's go talk to Pepper and see who else needs help on the island. Time to get Crick Crock Crook Ladee cracking. There should be something to do. There. Oh, it's, uh, it's Fisher. We've got some fishing to do. I wonder what kind of crazy fish we're gonna find. Whoops. There we go. Ahoy! I keep losing my hook. Making me lose my mind, too. I had to sell my car because I keep buying hooks. Luckily, I have great friends. Like you. Care to help out? Oh my goodness. I see an anglerfish. A jellyfish. Oh my, this is adorable. My grandson knows all about these. The Cleone is a floating sea slug. They are known for um being very cute. I don't remember it at all. Let's put this one in the river. But it's a sea it's a sea creature. <laughs> Why did we just put it in fresh water? I mean that this water's definitely pretty brackish, but still. Oh my, this is a jellyfish. If only we had a peanut butter fish. To the river. What is peanut butter fish making me think of? Wasn't Pudge in the Lilo and Stitch like movie? Didn't Lilo feed it peanut butter? Like peanut butter sandwiches? She 
She did? Okay, I thought so. I heard peanut butter fish and it like... <laughs> it, it awoke in an old memory. Oh my, this is... A puffer fish. The poor thing is all puffed up. All oh, that means it's stressed. Let's get it into the river stat. This is a sea snake? Oh my, this is... Oh no, it's an eel. A little wiggly guy. Wiggle wiggle. <laughs> Go wiggle in the river. Okay, we are missing... One last... Animal. It's gotta be behind this. Yep, it is. Oh my, this is very unsettling. Definitely the spookiest nightlight. Into the river with this one. I got a friend coin. Anglerfish are really cool and really creepy. The way they reproduce is, uh, is wild. Should be only one last thing to do here. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Ha, ah, just messing with you. Check out what's ribbiting over there, though. Wait. Wait, I just... I just helped him. That's weird. Is there a part two? I have a feeling the game may have just, uh, whoops. I have a feeling the game may have glitched out a little bit. He didn't say he had any other dialogue for me, either. We caught all fish. Thank you so much for your help. Spend that coin well. Oh, you know what? I think I... Maybe I did need to talk to him again. Let's go talk to Pepper one more time and see if that fixed it. Otherwise, I can go run around. Actually, you know what? It's right there. I see it. I see Blippy. Someone threw a huge coin in me. I'll help you, Blippy. Find all bones, and I will show you coin. Happy dog sounds. All right, let's get these, let's get these bones. There's one bone. There's two bones. Oh. Now you know what, it's okay. I accidentally fell off, but I found a bone in the process. I like the music that plays here. It's very calm. Oh, there's a bone. Alright, last bone. Oh, that was close. That was really close. And... go. 
Ta-da, here is coin. Very happy dog sounds. All right, I think that should have wrapped up this uh, this zone. But we're on to go clear out the final level. Unless there's a secret level. Yep, that's everything. On we go. Tadpole HQ. Welcome to Tadpole HQ. We're the largest company in the friendship biz. Wait, I know you. Pepper mentioned you in the company group chat. He couldn't stop bragging about you. Anyhow, have a great time at HQ. Make yourself at home. Hello, hi. DZ Witch, I'm doing good. How are you doing today? I'm having fun playing, uh... Here comes Nico, and it is, as always, very adorable. I am on what I assume is the last level. I'm good, just sleepy. Oh, me too. I was very tired when I woke up this morning. Who is this? I'm working right now, but I thought I'd lurk my crabby friend. Oh, thank you so much! I appreciate the lurk. Alice. Hey, you're that kid Pepper's always going on about. Nice to meet you. Want to be friends? Don't worry, I won't charge you, haha. -ha. Alright, I've made a friend. Oh my goodness. There's going to be a lot to explore here. Let's start this way. Yo, yeah, yo. Melissa. So this is where video games come from. I always thought they came from the store. Looks like it takes a lot of work. Who in their right mind would spend their time making video games? Oh, whoa, it's a, like a stick figure. Nico A0.45. They told me I would be the star of my own game. Turns out they only use me for prototyping. Do you think you're fancy with your colors and all? To me, you're just a tacky jerk. Buzz off, loser. Wow. That was a little rude. Code frog. I. I. I don't know, sir. Ricky. Why does your butterfly script need 20 sign calculations? Game Dev Studio up on up on top. Oh, it's Robofrog. Oh, this isn't the one from earlier. That was someone in a suit. Now it's just a robot. Hello, I am Robofrog. I am here to enhance your gaming experience. Would you like me to assist you by moving a colored puck? Perhaps you would like me to move a spinning top? Thank you, Robofrog. I appreciate you. Welcome to Tadpole Inc.'s Game Development Branch. Because every company needs a game development branch, right? With this new technology, I can finally experience the feeling of... 8,294,400 tiny LED lights flashing rapidly in front of my eyes. Oh, it's a Blippi. I got you, Blippi. Gotta hydrate. Everyone remember to hydrate, it's very important. Especially you, Griff, if you're not feeling well. You gotta hydrate too. Hooray, I'm free. I can finally get back to sniffing some butts. Sniff. Did, uh, did that make sound, by the way? 
The bonk worked. Okay, perfect. And you heard it? It didn't make sound. Okay, that's weird. It... It should have made sound. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, Grit, you used, uh, this program. Do I need to make an audio capture of it? I think I do, because I, I think I'm only capturing the, the visuals. You know what? That would make a lot of sense. Give me one second, and I can fix that. Right now. Okay, well, um, you know what? Let's try it right now. Here. Uh, tell me if you all can hear this. Okay. Perfect. Okay, uh, I think I needed to set up an audio capture on it then. Okay, I'm happy it's working. <laughs> Throw more to be safe. Okay, ju just for you, Grit. There you go. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Is it particularly loud when I press my but those buttons? By the way, does uh, does my mic pick that up? I see you are carrying 250 apples. Oh, oh. Give them to me. Nope, sounds like... Oh, perfect. Oh, 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 My secret oh. technique is quite simple. First, make sure you have 10 apples. Second, press jump and make sure to hold it. Don't let go of jump until you're thoroughly squished. Then release and... Hiya. Do you think you can do that? Oh. Interesting. Have I always been able to do that that technique? I think I have. I've just never tried. Wow. Let's go back up top. Oh, but first, let's grab a cassette. I'm happy it's not picking that up. I was worried it was every time I pressed a button. Oh, this is a this is a different office. You know what? I'll check that out in just a second. Time for some more plant puzzles. Oh my gosh, those look really complicated. My phone can handle the only sound option. <laughs> I think these buildings are where they sell the flower bulbs. Good thing no one noticed me sneaking up. You weren't followed, right? There were... There are four plots here that all need flowers. Okay. I think... Okay. Hidden one? No, I don't think it was. I think it just automatically threw it away. Okay, I think this one just looked more intimidating than it actually was.
Let's think. Close. Okay, I think I know what to do here. There's the shell. I think this should do it. Perfect. That's two down. One more, or two more to go. Wow, this, there, there's a lot of pots here. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, there's so many. There are so many. Uh, okay. Just put this here, why not? Alright, there's probably gonna be some serious trial and error here. Uh what is my favorite color? Uh it is between uh, I know this is gonna <laughs> this is gonna be a real a real shock, but it is between red and purple. It, it, I would say it's between red and purple. There is a really, uh, a really like bright shade of green that I like too. Like it's a very specific like hex code of green that I like. Uh, that is very, very bright on the eyes. Actually, I'll write it out in case anyone, in case you want to, in case you want to look it up. I really like that shade of green. It's very, very uh, vibrant. <laughs> okay, I missed like three. Uh, that shade of green, uh, supposedly, lines up with, uh, a wavelength of light that the, what is it, the rods or cones, whichever one sees color. I think it's rods. Uh, supposedly that lines up with the rods in our eyes, the most of every wavelength of light, and it's the most, like, vibrant, eye-catching, visible color to the human eye. I have no idea if it's true, but it seems true. you what is uh, all of your favorite colors you know what no I will try this I don't think that's the answer either I like 
pink, purple, and blue. Oh, those are all very nice colors. But other colors aren't wrong. Agreed. Every color can do can be really pretty. Uh, and used in, in a very nice, aesthetically pleasing way. Dang. If there was just one more of these triple pots, I could have wrapped it up right here. <laughs> yeah, beige is questionable. Beige is kind of nice, though. It can be really good for, like, uh... Beige is, like, good for furniture and, like, homes. Like, where you you want a color that's not just, like, uh, like white or gray. It's, like, a nice kind of neutrally warm, kind of warmish neutral color. I'm tempted to go down to the next puzzle. You know what? Should I do that? Let me see if the next one's harder. I don't think this one has me use and put down my own uh, pot, so this one might be a little better. Okay, I think I can see what I'm supposed to do here. I'm gonna try what I was doing earlier. Okay, that one was way easier. Whoa. That really launched me. Okay, now what to do on this one? This one's gonna take some real thinking. I think I just did it. I just did what I did on the last one. Okay, that was that wasn't so bad. Sometimes it's nice to just like uh, back away from a problem and then like come back to it later. Give give your uh, give your brain a, a chance to like work on it in the the back burner without you focusing on it. You did it. These were tough. I will admit. Yeah, that last one was tough. I plan to give my brother Gunter all these white flowers for his wedding. He's still single, but I'm thinking this will really put a flame under his butt. He can't possible, uh, possibly let all these flowers wilt, not without having a wedding first. Thanks for the help. Here's your cash. Oh, I see a cassette down there. Yeah, first try every time. <laughs> that is correct, Grit. There's a cassette right here, too. That's everything over here. Seems pretty thoroughly explored. I'm gonna go check out the beach where we played giant. Look at Plum Nice. Good day to y'all. Hello, Insomniac Wolfie. How are you doing? Good day to you too. This island is so big. I 
feel like there should be something over here. It kind of looks like this is just where you play the giant volleyball. Oh my goodness, I think that's it. I think the only thing you do over here is play giant volleyball. Well, okay. Let's explore over here a little bit more. So these statues are supposed to represent the Frog King. Can't say I see much resemblance. Oh, it's the Frog King. Assistant Frog, so tired. Hey you, do you work here? Not that it matters. This guy, my assistant, needs an immediate vacation. Just look at how miserable he is. Talk to me if you're up for the job. Ah, uh, you're ready to be my new assistant. Off to vacation with you, buddy. Oh, we'll see ya. So it's my assistant's job to listen to what I have to say. You know, what my schedule is like, my worries, deepest fears, crushes. Anyway, blah blah, corporate synergy, blah blah, yearly revenue. So, someone just asked me, where do you see yourself in five years? And I was like, do frogs even live that long? Long story short, I spiraled a bit, and now I own a motorcycle and like three skateboards. What am I supposed to do with those? I'm a frog. Another thing, do you ever wonder, like, what's up with the ocean? It's so big and so, so deep. Whatever lives in the deepest parts is either weirdly cute or extremely terrifying. That's probably true. Someone needs to figure this spooky stuff out. Can you keep a secret? Last week I met someone who I was totally into. And it looked like they were into me too. Very handsome, a thoughtful smile. Turns out I was looking at something called a mirror. You'd think I'd be mad, but the first step in finding love is loving yourself, you know? That felt good. Thanks, assistant number 23. Hee-ho, some money for you. You're a good assistant, number 23. Oh, look at that smile from Nico. Oh wait, that's the wizard frog who turns me into a frog. Pond party, pond party. Let's go wild and drink some age-appropriate beverages. Okay. Uh, I see... I see him. Uh, it's Gazbang. Hey, what's up, Gazbang? Any idea how long this game is? Uh, I'm not 100% sure, but it's day three. I streamed it all four hours on day two, and then maybe for an hour and a half, maybe give or take, on day one. Uh, and we're almost an hour into day, uh, to day three, so it's honestly not that long. Maybe six to eight hours, I would say? And and that's with me, like, 100%ing it. it. It would be my guess. Oh, there's another frog to talk to. This is my favorite spot. Just out of sight so the boss man can't see him taking the whole day off. Oh. Hey here. Hey here, small fry. You're looking at the 10 time employee of the month. Autographs are 10 bucks a piece. You look like you want to become employee of the month too. Ha. It's not that easy, small fry. Maybe once I retire, you'll have a chance. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. I'm only seven coins away, I don't know. Oh, this was the giant volley. Oh, it's a big crab.
Look at this crab. Very cute. <laughs> I like how its drum just says crab. Oh! It's a... It's a piano. I wonder if I'm supposed to, like, attempt to play a particular melody? Which I would not know which one that would be. You know what, this might just be a fun little spot. I'm thinking that was just a fun little area. What a good crab, yes. Another cassette. I see a bun bunch of fish jumping out. That can only mean fishers nearby. These statues look like like they're all taking a bath together. It's kind of cute. Ahoy! Where's my hook? Gone. I'm starting to think I might be losing them on purpose. You know, I've been thinking that since the beginning, Fisher. Maybe I keep losing them because it's much more fun to fish together with someone else. But Fisher, you said you were... You, like, had to sell your car for more hooks. You could have just been honest. Oh my, this is... A Neon Tetra. Or as I like to call it, half a Neon Octo. <laughs> Into the pond with this one. Oh, I might have missed that. Nope. Oh my, this is beautiful. My grandson always said it looked like a spaceship. Now he says it looks exactly like a blue streak cleaner race. Rass. Maybe it'll help clean the pond. No, my internet. I'll be back. And no worries. I'll just be here fishing. Hopefully it uh, fixes itself soon, though. Oh my, this is a blue fairy shrimp. The blueberry of the sea. To the pond with you. Oh, there's one right here. Oh my, this is a loach. Looks just like my soccer coach. Haha. I used to be quite the sports star in my day. I'd kick a ball with you, but at this age, fishing is more my speed. In the pond with this one. Alright, let's go get that last fish. Oh my, this is a honey garami. Don't be fooled, it tastes like fish. So it goes into the pond. Wait a minute, there's a bunch of no fishing signs. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> we caught all fish. Thank you so much for your help. Spend that coin well. Fisher, it specifically says not to fish. I guess he's not... He's not gonna let that stop him. Let's go check out the next little area. Oh, 
What's up, Blippy? I got you, Blippy. I think this probably is the last Blippy puzzle. Find all bones. Okay. Oh, it's a bunch of nets. This would be more bouncy. Guess not. Another bone. Oh. I thought something might be under there. See a bone there. I'll grab that on the way down. Well, which was almost right there. There we go. Oh, here we go. There's bone four. And there's bone five. Ta-da, here's coin. see a cassette. I don't like how realistic the hand is on that rivet gold card. It might have been everything, but I'm going to go up top. Oh no, actually, it's probably not everything. Why did I jump off? Oh no. Can I make it up? I think I can. Oh. He saved it. Looking for Pepper? He is at the top of the skyscraper. The soda can is out of order. These things are pretty expensive. It'll cost 15 coins to fix. I'll pay. Wow, so generous. Okay. Oh, and here's... Here's Sir Sir. Lewis said he was going to look for a bathroom. I don't think these frogs have a bathroom. To be honest, I should have gone with that old rascal. All right, well, I know where this is now. I'm going to go up top to Pepper later. That kind of feels like a wrap-up to the game kind of, kind of section. Oh, it's the... It's Blessly. Devourer of bugs. Be sure you always have a great big smile on your face. You never know who's taking pictures. Yes, I'm not only a food connoisseur, I'm also a high-stake businesswoman. But I'm not here to do business. But this island actually hosts a variety of bugs. Can you get me a bug? Melange of about 30 uh -huh. specimens? Thanks. Okay, so it's still 30. I almost have it. I don't think I ever went up here. I think it's time to do that. I've been researching the costs of implementing stepladders in our standard equipment. Tall people need friends, too. Hi, 
Hi there! I'm head of R&D here at Tadpole Inc. Would you like to hear about our latest project? Check this out. Instead of saying, I am here for you, our professional friends could start saying, I hear you. That's 40% fewer words. We're going to save big money. That's Mitch. You there. Want to trade five cassettes? Yes, please. All right, you got it. When I implied, I thought R&D stood for rice and dumplings. Ooh, that sounds good. Ugh, I'm starving. <laughs> There's a frog up here playing the trumpet. That was very cute. This floor is dedicated to accounting. That means we make up random numbers and send them to the tax bureau. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. That would be a fraud. What, what the frog is a capital gains tax? Oh my gosh, there's so much coffee drink up here. I was sleepy, now I'm not. Very thing is going so slow. And to get back to work. Numbers, 14%. 5% plus, mm, or minus, mm. Mm, money. Oh my goodness, look at that frog. Somebody help them. Come back to me when you have at least five cassettes. Yeah, I need to find some more. Uh, where is our turtle friend? There he is. Oh, bug. Wait, I need to grab that. I need to grab bugs too. Two bugs to go. Okay, now let's go talk. I was looking for a bathroom, but I got lost. Can you bring me back to Sershal? Don't jump more than two times, please. I don't think this is going to help. Uh, you know what? Maybe it will. I'll remember I can do that. Okay, I can take that. Oh, I probably could have done that without jumping at all. Okay, we're gonna be okay. There we go. That took two jumps. We're too old to work in an office like this. Living it doesn't sound like a good plan either. It was fun to be in such a space again, though. So nostalgic. Donk Jewel. These frogs should really get their bathroom situation straightened out. I used to work in an office. Can you believe it? It wasn't much fun at all. Uh, you know what? Let's go talk to Blessly. And then I guess we'll go up top, because... 
Well, actually, then I'll go check the whiteboard. Let's see what I'm missing. Aww. Do I smell bugs? Give them to me. Goodbye, Chris. They blend so beautifully. Very tasty. As a high-stake businesswoman, I've got plenty to spare. Take this coin, sweetie. What's my line? Okay, let's go find the whiteboard and take a look at it. There's got to be at least two cassettes on this island. Otherwise, I won't be able to finish the puzzle. And I think I've gotten everything else. Oh, you know what? I think the whiteboard might actually be up top. You know what? We're going to go up top. Could a cassette be up on top of this? You know what? Jumping from there earlier would definitely not have worked. Great, you're here. It's time for your final task. Can you guess what it is? It's a job interview. We can't be hiring someone without the classic corporate staple that is a formal interview. Be warned, we like to stretch the meaning of formal. Cue the music. Question one, the first. What is my name? Oh no. Uh, <laughs> Pepper. Ding ding. There are no right answers in a job interview, but this is a good one. Question two, the one after the first. What is your name? Nico. Noted. Question three, the one that would kill me if I had a big glowing eye. <laughs> How many decades of experience do you have being a professional friend? Zero. Hmm, too bad. Question four, the one that's just for you. What makes you most excited about this position? Helping others. I hear you, bud. Question five, halfway through this stressful social interaction. What's 31 squared? Uh... Nine hundred and... Oh, you know what? Quick, uh, chat, tell me, what is, uh... What's 31 squared? <laughs> I feel like it should be neither of the- I'm gonna guess 972. He said there's no wrong answers. Correct. I think. I have no idea. They don't teach math at frog school. Question six. Keep that in mind. How many questions have I asked? Does that count this one? I'm gonna- oh wait, maybe the first question. I'm gonna say it's a trick and go with seven. Correct. We're at question six of the interview, but before I started, I asked, it's time for your final task. Can you guess what it is? I knew it. Question seven, what's more stressful than social interactions? The future. Where do you see yourself in five years? Don't wanna think about that. <laughs> Follow your dreams, kid. Question eight, we're getting close to the end. What is the name of the forest we visited? I believe that was Salmon Creek. Someone's got a good memory. Question nine, the penultimate. Do you think you'll get this job? Yes. Noted. Question 10, the final one. One more question. Did you enjoy being a professional friend? Absolutely. 
Perfect. Oh, prefect. You can't improve unless you're enjoying yourself. Those were all the questions I had. Gotta process this. Whether you got the job or not, I can't say. We'll send you an email tomorrow. It's been a busy trial period. You must be tired. Thank you for your time. I'll be sending you home now. Goodbye. What? Well, wait, what? Well, that's a big grin, though. Oh! It's Nico's dad. Hey. Found you. You look great. Um. Don't worry. I won't tell her where you are. I just wanted to see you. I'm sorry with how things went. I should have protected you. Just know that nothing about this is your fault. You did great and I'm proud of you. I'll do my best to turn the situation at home around. It might be best if you keep living here. At least for a little while. If there's anything you need, I'm just a phone call away. Oh. It looks like my stop is coming up. See you around. I love you. Aw. I hope I get like a, a bonus thing once I get them all. How did he manage to find me? It doesn't matter. I'm glad I got to see him again. Aw. Ugh. I totally screwed that job interview. Actually, I feel like I did pretty good. What even were those questions? There aren't any other job listings in this area. What if I have to move out again? I guess I can start packing when I get home. This sucks. I don't want to move. This place is actually kind of nice. For the first time in a while, I felt like I belonged somewhere. Maybe some things are too good to be true. I'm back home. Checks heart. Yep, yep. My heart went out due to the sweet moment there. Lovely game. Yes, I agree. Oh, my credits. Oh, I'm hired. Oh, that's cute. They threw a party. Surprise, you're hired. You passed the trial with flying colors. I still gotta go get the last bit. I organized this party to welcome you to the family. You won't believe how fast I had to swim to get here before you. I'm exhausted. Go walk around. There are a lot of people who want to see you. I'm so proud of you. Aww. Oh my, you caught yourself a job. Best catch of the year, I'd say. You know, I used to always have my hook on me. Back then, I went fishing with my grandson every day. When he moved to go study marine biology, I was real happy for him. But fishing hasn't been the same since. Until you came along, that is. Welcome to the crew. With a bit of work, you could become employee of the month. Congratulations. I gotta admit, I was a bit disappointed when I heard the news. I was gonna hire you as a full-time vehicle tester. <laughs> we did it. That's what we did. We, we made it. We got hired. Although in hindsight, our health plan is probably insufficient for the line of work. Anyhow, we should eat sunflower seeds together sometime. Smile. Sweetie, you got a job. You gotta capture this moment. Right. Vlog frog. Okay. Oh, my eyes. <laughs> That's such a good... Those, those are such good sound clips. Wonderful to hear you're starting your career well. Don't forget to have a life outside of work, alright? Congrats, congrats. You impressed me, kid. Hi. There's a lot of people here. It's a bit scary. I wouldn't forgive myself for missing your party, though. I haven't seen this many people in forever. This just be enough socializing for the coming decade. <laughs> Nani? It looks like Pepper told you to go home only to surprise you with this big party. He knew you were hired all along. Case closed. Oh hey, congrats on all that. This was the first party I didn't have to drag Gunter to. He's pretty excited. Looks like he's hitting it off too. Okay. I guess he's hitting it off with uh, with Maggie. They are both really shy, although Gunter seems to be less shy now. I guess I helped him I helped him out with that. No one has talked to me yet. Is there someone something on my face? Oh, there's a tadpole. 
Congrats, Fishstick. You got a job. Don't let your boss push you around. Surprise! When you're a big hotshot business person, don't forget the fire in your heart that is Volley. You're the champion, after all. Surprise! You got that job like a, an amazing job getting dragon. Keep it up. You're doing great. So many people to talk to. We managed to get here without Lewis wandering off once. I think he was really excited to celebrate your accomplishment. Proficiat. Surprise! I found you this time. This party is fun. Perfect for a lovely person such as yourself. Aww. Oh, more people to talk to. It's you! You got a job. That's cool, I guess. Jobs are kind of boring. <laughs> I love how this kid talks. But if it allows you to do my epic challenges, I guess it's alright. I gotta be honest, we haven't had the most varied conversations. That's probably on me. Regardless, I'm really proud of you. You did it. You did it all. Hey, hey, hey. We finally get to talk. Seeing you walk around and be such a good friend to everyone around you. It's inspiring. You're the coolest. I shall talk to him last. Congratulations! You won the job! It was a long walk for someone who was a 300 pound arcade cabinet. Thank you so much for, for to playing my game. <laughs> Rival, you have bested me at the one thing I was never able to do. Get a job. Well done. I won't let you go... Go this easy, though. We'll be rivals forever and ever. I'll make sure of that. Oh, I can talk to Train Kid. Oh, I guess not. Train Kid's just enjoying the moment. Oh, there's people back there. I'm sitting here because I'm a little tired. I'm not lazy. It was a long walk from the train. Yo. Look at you. Yo. Business hotshot. Yo. Yo. I've heard Yo. you're a professional friend. Yo. Yeah. That sounds Yo. like the perfect job for you. Yo. You got a job? Yo. Not very rebellious, I'd say. Ha. Ha. But very cool nonetheless. Yo. Just keep rebelling. Ha. Hey, kiddo. Ha. You got a job, I see. Ha. Yo. You're growing up quick. Yo. Don't forget to have a moment to take it all in, alright? Can I talk to... Everybody? Do you have anything to say? Mm -hmm. The train to financial stability has left the station, and you're on it. Oh, that was nice. Uh, let's go check out what's on this island. We'll just kind of abandon the party temporarily, it's fine. Oh, there is stuff over here. Oh, what's the the car the mahjong? Pang. I don't think I can climb up on that. Uh, I guess let's go back to our house. Maybe there's something over there. Oh, there's more people. Hey, you. Have you heard about the employee of the month? You should check it out at Tadpole HQ. Ribbit, ribbit. Oh, this was our neighbor. Hey, there you are. You leave my sight for a moment and suddenly you're the talk of the town. What do you say? This place is pretty alright now. It is a lovely little town. The end. Thank you for playing. Aw. I only need two more points. I am, uh, locked into this. Now that I've gone in here. It's such a nice game, gosh. Yeah, it was. That was a very nice, cute, like, inspiring little game. Well, I guess we kind of have to wait a minute while uh, the credits finish, because uh, I, I want to go finish 100%ing uh, the game, because I think I'm really close. Two coins, and then maybe, like, two cassettes. <laughs> I 
Thank you, Grit. <laughs> we celebrate the moment with a little something. This, these credits aren't uh, on loop, are they? I actually kind of am wondering if they're on loop. Oh, I was able to get out. Maybe not. I get in the train. Oh, I missed something at the pool. I'm happy it had a happy ending. Like, Nico, Nico's mom clearly hasn't quite, like, accepted Nico yet, but it looks like Nico's dad did, and they're, he's gonna try. Cute game should have a good ending. Yeah. There are no coins left. I don't understand. There are no coins left, but I... I must not be able to earn this coin yet. I guess I'll come back here. I think it said I'm missing three cassettes and one coin. All right, we're going to find out something very important right now. Right now, chat. If I go talk to Pepper up top again, is he going to point me in the right direction this time? Or is he going to start that ending sequence again? Now I would hope he'll he'll point me in the right direction. And it's not going to start the ending sequence again. Wait a minute. There's something here. Oh, okay. I'll just fall off. Let's try that again. I had a nightmare like this once. Glad to know that dreams do come true. Oh. Okay, I'm going to need some help. I bought... Oh, wait, no, I already saw that one. Today is the most exciting and most terrifying day of my life. I'm finally leaving. With a lot of help from Sarah and a bit flawless acting on my part, I managed to escape. This will be my last bottled message because I just got my very own phone. Farewell, old boy. I'll miss you, I guess. Nico. Oh my, there are no coins left to earn here. Great job. Check out the board to see if you missed anything else. Okay, good, I didn't restart. Interesting, though, that... Oh, it's because the, the coin is for giving the cassettes over. That makes sense. Right? Oh my, there are no coins. Yeah. It's because I don't have the cassettes. Oh boy. There are three whole cassettes left to earn here? Well, time to get looking.
Hopefully these cassettes aren't too bad to find. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna hit all of these. I think Nico is gonna have a good life here with all these silly animals. I agree. Okay, I probably should have started. Oh. They all start a different instrument. Okay, maybe now let's try. If this doesn't work, then this might just really be a for fun thing. Alright, I think that is just a cute little thing. Uh, what island is this? This is uh, Tadpole HQ. one up in this tree. Yeah. Oh my goodness, let me up there. Well, I found one in this tree. feeling there might be one in there because of these umbrellas. It, it seemed a little, uh, a little convenient. Okay, so that should be two cassettes left. I feel like there's a real chance it could be hidden in the, uh, in a, in a bush, since that other one was just hidden in a tree. Wait, I don't think I ever talked to this rock. It, Itadaki Masu. Oh, it's a sushi rock. I've got a list where they are if you end up needing help. Oh, thank you. Okay. If I don't find them in the next couple minutes, I will, uh, I will get your help. I'm hoping that they're just kind of sitting somewhere easy. Oh wait, I already dashed. I don't want that. You know, I, I just realized, instead of using the umbrella, I could have used the super jump from the apple. I wonder if it's under the umbrella. Oh, 
I'm under the rock. Huh, <laughs> that was weird. Okay, the other place, I didn't see anything, but maybe there's something over here. It's the giant island. Guess I'll just hit the volleyball. Maybe it's under it. Nope. So intimidating. I don't think there was anything on this island. I guess there was one just in a bush here. I, I was right, they would just hide one in a bush. Well, that means I can go get one of the coins. I think it's up here, right? Yes. Hey, 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 wanna trade five cassettes? Yes, please. All right, you got it. Okay, I should be missing at this point one cassette on this level and then one coin back at the pool level. And then that's it. Tall trees really do seem like they would have it. Nope. Let's try this tall tree. Nope. Let's try the trees over here. Could also be in another bush over here. Nope. Not in here. Uh, Grit, do you, uh, do you know where the last one is? Like, have you got it narrowed down to which, which is the one I'm missing? We have a list for this island, okay. Does it involve this little uh, music section? Uh, you know what? You're, you, since you're a, a moderator, I imagine you can post a link. Yeah, me as well. I feel like I've kind of thoroughly explored the island. It's probably in a really hard to reach spot. Okay. I'm gonna look around this train one more time, and if it's not over here, I'm gonna click the link. Alright, I'm gonna click the link. Uh, 
let's see. In the bushes, around the bench. Okay, let's check these places really quick. In the bushes, around the bench, just after getting off the train. Okay, I got that one. In the nearby pond where ponds and fractals in the water that will shoot you to it. It says there's a soda can in the water. Well, it says... That's interesting. In some rocks past Fisher. I must have already gotten this one, then. Because it said it's next to the frog with the inflatable tube. So I must have already grabbed this one. Yeah, I must have got that one already. In the air past the building... Soda can above Searchle. Oh, you know what? I don't know if I, if I touch that can. That might be it right there. This might be it. Let's see if this does it. Oh. That would be it. Gotta go. Have a nice day, Plum, and chat. Bye. Thanks for joining, John. Have a good rest of your day. And we'll see you next time. Okay. So, it's a good thing you dropped that link, uh, Grit, because that was, uh, that was tough. It's funny, uh, I saw those cans earlier, and I just didn't think to check them. Okay, so that's everything here. Oh, and that's the can in the water that would have shot me up into the tree. This should be the very last thing in the game, I, I think. I'm going to check the train, actually, real quick again, just to make sure. 100%. 100. 100%. 100%. 100. Nope. 100. 100. Okay. This... Oh, shoot. Why did I press B? I'm so used to hitting back. Let's get this thing. Yes. As soon as we get back here. I accidentally shot myself over to uh, to the wrong spot. Let's see if uh, Pepper will point me in the right direction now. Oh my, there are no coins left to earn here. Okay. That's very interesting. But Pepper says there's no coins left to earn here. Hey, what's this? I used to play soccer. It was pretty ballin'. <laughs> I wonder if there's just a hidden coin. All right, 
Alright, we're gonna check. Because this this is very confusing. Public pool, okay. Okay, we solved the crime. Arcade machine. Catch all the fish, trade by cassettes, sports, sportival volley. Did I do this? Yeah, I did the water one. Oh no, this is water volley. This one said it was for sport vival. Is there another volleyball challenge here? Uh, you know what? That must be the one. I think it's just written wrong. Catch all fish. Collect 30 cicadas. Trade cassettes. Little Gabby. I actually don't know what I missed. I, I feel like I got all of those. I, I, I must not have. I guess I'm just going to run past all of them real quick. Let's go to the faraway island. Yes, I got the coin there. She's happy. I got the coin there. Oh, there's the cannon. I think it's this. Oh, wow, I uh, I was tabbed out for a second. Sorry, I didn't see what, what was going on in chat. <laughs> I was reading this guide. Uh, poll results are in. Diana Cycle, hi, I hope you're having a good time. What game is this, if you don't mind me asking? Hey, welcome in, this is Here Comes Nico. Uh, yes, hi! Welcome in, Fiona. Uh, I'm playing Here Comes Nico. Uh, I have pretty much finished the game. Um, I am... It was very cute little uh, 3D platforming collectathon. Uh, it was it was incredibly cute and very lovely. Uh, I have I have one last thing I need to collect. Uh, and I will have 100% of the game. And it's somewhere here on this stage I'm on right now. And because I've been looking for, for a little bit, uh, I am using a guide. Normally I try not to do, but in the interest of wrapping it all up, because I'm at the very end, I figured it's okay. I missed that. But yes, it's been so cute and so fun. Very refreshing. Fell again. Oh my goodness. You know what? I'm gonna try to see if I can just super jump. Oh wow. That really launches you. Saber won the poll. Oh, good! I'm excited, Grit. Have you figured out when you want to do that? 
Did I get the coin that was at the very end, though, past that can? I, I think I did. Okay. Solve crime, arcade machine, get the bones, get the fish, catch all the fish. I did that. Trade five cassettes. Two people want me to trade them five cassettes. Let me make sure I've talked to both of them. I just... I just found and talked to Mai. Oh, did I give her the bugs? That might be what I missed. Let me see. Oh, the pool. Perfect place to go bug hunting. Do you hear that noise? The cicadas are calling you. Could you bring me 30? This is what I'm missing. Okay. We just need to get the cicadas. That's not so bad. There's one. So I'll wait for that one to come back. Let's go give Blessly these bugs. These poor cicadas. About to have a bad time. Do I smell bugs? Give them to me. Oh my, that was delicious. Thanks, sweetie. The buzzing makes it extra spicy. Here's some money, sweetie. Thanks, sweetie. Okay, that should do it. Let's go back to Frog HQ. Or Tadpole HQ. And go look at the Employee of the Month board. And see, see what happens. I hope it's something cool. Achievement unlocked. Employee of the Month. Oh, nice. Okay, this might... I got an achievement for it, which is good. Oh, look, it's... <laughs> I think I got your good side. I can't believe you've done this. What am I supposed to do now? Oh, and now he's ex-employee of the month. Tell my kids their father is a complete fool? An epic failure? This is ridiculous. I could have easily gotten that many coins if I had the time. Someone has to stay here to keep my pictures clean. Ugh. Congratulations, I guess. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go talk to... Pepper again. And then I'll go back to the house, just to see if anything has changed. Uh, but it looks like we 100 percent it. I just think it's funny that Nico's like, they're sticking out. Yeah, I thought that was funny, too. I don't think they were supposed to be sticking out. Which makes it even funnier. Are 
our dearest frog king needs some assistance with his assistant. He's down there if you want to help out. Oh. Interesting. Is there more to do? Or I wonder if it's just kind of glitching out now. No, there's a question mark. You're a good assistant, number 23. Oh, no, that's it. Uh, let me go back up there again. That was that was very strange. It's possible that just getting that employee of the month is it, which would be fine. I wouldn't be like mad about that. I was hoping for like one last interaction though, like one last little bit of story. We'll go back home after this. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna head back to the house and see if there's anything there. And then uh, I think that'll wrap it up. We'll uh, we'll take a short break after that, and we'll set up for uh, for Demon Turf, which I think is gonna be a very different game. <laughs> would like in the train. There we go. Okay. Back home. Oh, the party's still going on here. Oh, and it starts the credits. I see. Okay, and it starts this again. I already did that. We did it, guys. Oh, someone is pounding on my door outside. Uh, give me one second. This is a good time to take a break anyways. I'll be back in just a few minutes after I'm done setting up. Thank you. 